loves welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new to my channel then hey my name is natasha morrison and thank you so much for coming over to my channel and if you clicked on this video then you already know that when we're talking about my weight gaining journey i actually had one of my followers hit me up on on instagram and she basically asked me to do an update video talking to you guys about my current weight gaining journey and what's been happening and i have been meaning to film this video for a while actually all right so let me just give you guys if you haven't seen my video where i talk to you guys about my struggles to gain weight i'm going to link it up here somewhere check that video out because it's very insightful and it, i will give you guys a background about all my eating problems my struggles to gain weight my struggles to eat and all that good stuff all right so just to kind of make this video really quick and snappy i want to tell you guys some key things that i've been doing that's really helped with me eating on a regular basis and which has ultimately helped me to gain weight firstly going to the gym i love 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 going to the gym because whenever i go to the gym i am hungry like i'm starving whenever i'm going to the gym I always eat just before I go to the gym to give myself a bit of energy. I will probably do that about an hour, an hour and a half before I go to the gym. And then after a workout, I feel so hungry. Like I feel like I'm just a monster. I feel like my stomach just growls at me. I'm starving. After a workout, all I can think about is food. Like that's it. And normally when I finish the gym, I will go to the supermarket and probably buy like a meal, a meal deal. And I will literally devour that meal deal like there and then. And then probably when I get home, I will eat my dinner. That's how hungry I am guys. I'll eat twice in like the space of like an hour, an hour and a half. I probably have my dinner, but I have like a really light portion. And then the next tip as well that I'm gonna tell you guys is that find yourself a gym buddy. I feel like going to the gym is so hard when you go by yourself it's really hard to motivate yourself to go but when you have like a gym buddy like i have two of my best friends who i go to gym with all the time or if one isn't available i'll go with the other and we just really push each other and it's so nice because going to the gym helps me to gain weight it helps me not only mentally physically but it helps with my appetite another thing that i started to do which has helped me so much is keeping a logbook of what i eat so i've been using this app called fit my fitness pal or fitness pal and on that app you can literally track your calories you put in all your details how tall you are the got your um the weight that you want to achieve your current weight all of this good stuff and it will tell you how much calories you should be eating every day to get to that goal and every time i eat i would literally scan my food and i'm telling you i was so surprised that i have bought some food and think and i thought nah this is not going to be on here and dang y'all it was on there like they had they literally know everything i don't know if they go to the supermarkets and be scanning everything or whatever but literally that app has literally saved my life and it was because of that app that i realized that i had a major eating problem because before i started tracking my calories and eating more i would probably eat one meal every two days one meal every two days Can, did you hear that one meal every two days and i'm not someone who snacks so i wouldn't snack and that's just not it but since i've started to use this app i'm more able to track my calories track what i'm eating and that has really helped me so much all right so as you guys know well if you if you've tuned into my channel or watched any of my other videos i took a petamin probably about two two and a half years ago now and i want to link that video up here somewhere and a petamin really helped me to gain weight and i think when i took the petamin i started off at about 50 or 55 kgs one of those i can't remember one of those weights and i ended up going up to about 62 63 kgs when i stopped taking a petamin i think my weight stayed at about that 60 and it fluctuated between about 57 56 62 around those areas i would always be somewhere between those weights depending on what was going on with my life if i was going for a really hard time then i'll go down if i was going through a good time in my life and i was eating and stuff i'll be a bit up but currently i'm about 60 kgs and i've literally been stagnant at that same weight so i have decided to go back on a petamin and i've done a video already 
on my channel so go check that video out I'm gonna link it up here and I'll link it in the description box I have started to take a peppermint again because now I'm ready to go up a bit more in my weight and a peppermint did help me to increase my weight and I was able to sustain that same weight for the last two years but I've literally been that same weight for the last two years and now I'm kind of ready to move up a bit more and gain a little bit more weight so you guys can be a little bit you know a little slim thing a slim thick thing around here so yeah so gym tracking your meals my fitness pal also so 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 important guys if you are bad at remembering to go eat because I know some people are like how do you not remember to eat like how do you not how do you how do you miss your meals like who doesn't remember to eat me I literally forget to eat like if I'm doing something and I'm hungry that hunger will pass right on by and I'll feel fine and that was the habit that was my habit for like years so my body's pretty much used to be doing that but now what I started to do is set reminders literally on my phone I would have an alarm that goes off probably every four hours every three hours that says eat eat and I'll have that alarm go off a few times and whatever I'm doing I will stop what I'm doing and go straight to the kitchen and have something to eat and that has helped me so so much with tr going to the gym tracking my calories and what I eat setting myself reminders and what else have I done to gain weight those are pretty much the three things that I've been doing to gain weight and like I said currently I've been maintaining that 60, 62, 63 weight um, because I think around December time I actually was down to about 56, 57 kgs but now I'm back in the 60 kg category but you guys ready to move on by move on to the next stage of my weight gaining journey so I would advise anyone out there that if you are going to start this weight gaining journey oh yeah how can I forget this another thing as well when you're trying to gain weight don't be worried about what you're eating like i was thinking about becoming a pescatarian and i was just like girl you stupid like you stupid or what like you're already struggling to eat on a normal basis like to eat anything now you're gonna now go and be a pescatarian and limit yourself to the type of food you can eat like no don't do that so i feel like it's so important when you're on your weight gain journey just to eat just focus on eating and building that habit of eating food once you're in the once you're once you've built that habit and you're more consistent at eating then you can kind of say you know what i've been consistent at eating for six months now let me become a pescatarian because when you change your diet to just become a vegan or pescatarian you are limiting yourself on the type of food you can eat so don't worry about what you're eating when you're gaining weight i know some people might come for me come for me for saying this but honestly for someone who struggles to eat just eat like that's what i've had to just say just eat don't worry about this or that or anything like don't be eating junk food all the time obviously but try to just eat food in your house buy ready meals buy little oven pizzas buy little patties like i'm telling you there's stuff out there and i'm looking at the calories like damn this sandwich has like 500 calories whoa another thing as well eat loads of nuts i've been eating nuts so much like i get the three my supermarket tesco's has this offer where you can get like three packs three for two and i always buy the little packs and i throw them in my handbags in my um, gym bag in my work bag so whenever i'm hungry i will eat one of those and they're literally they're not even that big and those little protein bags protein bags those little bags of fruits and nuts and little berries and stuff i think they give you about 500 calories like for real for real i was gonna start taking protein shake i did buy a protein shake to take but i'm really skeptical about that because my friends have been telling my my guy friends have been telling me that you know don't take it it's got this ingredient in it that will just give you water weight like you blow up and you look thick but once you stop taking a protein shake you'll shrink back down so i have a protein shake there i'm gonna probably start taking it and eat healthy and eat more food with it but yeah so those are pretty much the things i've been doing to gain weight just eat just go to the gym find a gym buddy to go to the gym track your calories with an app write it in your notes 
whatever you can do just track your calories track what you're eating just so that you know not necessarily because you're counting calories just so that you know how much you're eating on a regular basis or not because I found out by tracking my calories that I was not eating on a regular basis and it was quite disturbing the next thing as well is set reminders on your phone alarms to go off when you need to eat and say to yourself whenever that alarm goes off you're gonna get up go to the kitchen go somewhere and buy something to eat don't worry about what you're eating just eat just eat anything um, try and eat healthy obviously because you don't want all the weight to go to your stomach and your face and all the places that ain't really cute so make sure you're eating healthy meal prepping I'm not really a meal prep type of girl but it can help some people and yeah so those are the things that I've currently been doing to help with my weight gaining journey like I said I am back on a petamin and if you guys want to see a video where I tell you guys about the first few days of me taking a petamin then please go check that video out but yeah i'm just going to summarize this video now if you guys want more content where i'm telling you guys about my weight gaining journey if you guys want actual footage obviously right now the world is in lockdown and also i'm just hoping that you guys are staying at home and keeping yourself safe during this time right now it's just so crazy what's going on in the world so please make sure you keep yourself and your families safe but if you guys want to see any videos about weight gaining obviously i'm going to be doing my petamin videos and taking you guys on that journey i'm doing home workouts at the moment but if you guys want to see gym workouts once i get back into the gym let me know in the comment section below but anyway i'm kind of rambling on now so let me just end the video here if you guys like this video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit the subscription button if you've come all the way to this part of my video then skr skr you a real one like i love you thank you so much but please don't forget to hit that subscription button down below leave me a comment in the comment section and please just share this video as well anyone who you know who's struggling to gain weight you know tell them that your girl natasha i got you i got you but anyway until my next video i will see you guys then so bye my loves